Here I'm going to show you how to show the current date every day in the worksheet in Excel so that you have something nice and beautiful like this with the name of your report or your worksheet and then the current date right here. So every day you open the worksheet, that's going to update to show the current day. So let's go to the next worksheet and make this guy right here. And just imagine there's a beautiful report under here at the bottom. All right, so this is how we start out and just give it whatever title you want. And we can do a little bit of formatting over here and give it a title, a bold, and make it look better than this. And here we're going to zoom in. And all we do is we're going to go over one cell and do equals today. That is the beautiful, beautiful function returns the current date formatted as a date enter and there we go but of course that doesn't look very nice so go here and you can either go to the home tab and choose from one of the very few options for the date here long date works quite nicely I do like that one but what you can do is right click and go to format cells it's off the screen at the moment you're going to get this lovely window go to the number tab and date and you have a bunch of options so choose one that works well for you. We'll go back with the long one, hit OK. And everything seems good, but let's make one change. Let us make it so that column B is not so big because we want to put some data below it. So what we can do is just select multiple cells and on the home tab, go to merge and center. Let's click the drop down arrow though and just go to merge cells and let's make it left aligned there we go so now we have nice normal sized columns that we can put our data into use however we want this is one big merged cell and it shouldn't cause any problems because it's just to display the user a value it's not actually going to be used in our formulas or at least that's the premise of this tutorial then we go to view and we uncheck grid lines and there we go we have the beginnings of a nice, beautiful little report that's going to show the user the current weekday, month, day, and year. One little thing I'll show you right here at the end is there's another great little function that I must include with this, and it is the now function. Returns the current date and time formatted as a date and time. So if we use this one, let us just make this a little bigger then you're going to get the time there at the end of it as well. And format it just like I showed you, go to format cells, number tab, and choose an option from there. So that's how you can show the user the current date every day in Excel.